Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. It is football Thursday at DocSports.com because today, just like every other week during the football season, Thursday afternoons, we release our College of Pro Football plays for the entire week, Thursday through Monday, all available today at DocSports.com. You know how well we've done? We're 60% so far this season in college football, and uh, we are perfect 2-0 with my top-rated plays. What do I got going for this weekend? Well, Saturday, I've got a seven-star play in college. College football. I've also got a six-star play going in Sunday's NFL. We've got college football. We've got NFL. Right through Monday night, by the way, I am involved in the battle between the Saints and the Raiders as the Raiders kick off the new stadium here in Las Vegas. It all starts with Thursday night football. I do have a play in the battle between the Bengals and the Browns. So it's all available on Thursday over at DocSports.com. We're up over $9,600 for $100 per unit players on my current football run going back to late September of 2018. And again, seven-star play in college football is the, the top play of the entire weekend for me. We're a perfect 2-0 thus far with our highest-rated college football plays. Wanted to also mention that the WNBA is back in playoff action on Thursday after taking Wednesday off. We started the WNBA playoffs on Tuesday with a seven-star winner. I've got a six-star play on Thursday. 21-8 with our last 29 WNBA plays up over $6,000 for $100 per unit better. As you can grab that on Thursday at DocSports.com. I'm also involved in Major League Baseball. We're looking to go to 4-0 this week uh, on the bases. And uh, we're going to pass the NHL clash between the Islanders and the Lightning. Uh, not enough info yet on whether Braden Point is going to be playing for Tampa Bay. So good time to pass for us. I'll just say this. If Point is on the ice, if he starts, if he's able to play, I would have been on Tampa Bay. So you'll know that. Uh, so a lot going on for me on Thursday. And of course, the star of the show, the football package. Thursday night through Monday night, I'm involved in Thursday football, Saturday college football, on the seven star NFL action on Sunday, NFL Monday Night Football. We got it all this week over at DocSports.com. Real quick note NBA. WNBA, you can get either sport for $149 for the rest of the playoffs right now in the NBA or the WNBA and in the NHL right now, you can get the rest of the playoffs for 95 bucks over at DocSports.com. Uh, so anyway, big day for us on Thursday. Go check out the football package if you wish. And again, the seven-star college football play for Saturday uh, is the lead play. We are in action between the Browns and the Bengals on Thursday night. Let's get to our free college football play for Saturday. For the second straight week, we're going to be on the North Carolina Tar Heels, and I know this number got bumped up a little bit from 27 and a half, but for good reason. I don't think it's high enough. Listen, we had North Carolina last week. They cashed, and what I noticed about that was they had a little bit of an adjustment time getting used to that new 335 Syracuse defense. Once they did, they got to the fourth quarter, and they cut loose, and you saw Sam Howell go 25 for 34, nearly 300 yards passing. On the flip side, you had a situation for Charlotte in which they covered a number against App State, only lost by 15, getting about a point and a half or so more than that, uh, but they gave up over 500 yards. They gave up over six yards per carry, and now they're going to be starting a transfer Juco at quarterback because their planned starting quarterback was injured. I just think Mac Brown continues to keep North Carolina headed in the right direction, so even though this has gone up a little bit from where it was when it opened, we still like the Tar Heels to get the job done. We think it's going to be start to finish in this one rather uh, than getting used to a defense and then cutting loose in the final quarter of play. We like North Carolina minus the points, our free pick for Saturday. I will be right back here early Friday morning. We'll take a look at where the public is on the upcoming weekend in football, where the sharps are, Joes versus pros, all that kind of good stuff with our next report. And as far as college football free pick videos, uh, again, we'll be on North Carolina on Saturday. We'll have some more videos for you over the next 24 to 48 hours, including a free pick in the NFL. And don't forget footballthursdaydocsports.com. Go check it out if you're interested in my football plays for this weekend's action. All right, if you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritzer, docsports.com.